Hi, I'm Cesar Samayoa from the Broadway musical Come From Away, and there are thousands of real-life characters in this incredible story, and I play at least five of them. I'm going to show you how I came about doing these characters from the ground up. So one of the featured characters that I play is Kevin Jay, and he is based on a real life person. He's one of two uh, Kevins in the show. They're a couple from California, and my Kevin, uh, as much as he appreciates his time in Gander and the kindness here, really wants to get home to New York. Hi, I'm Kevin, and I just wanna go home and have a drink. I based my whole first take on this character through the script and through the writing. The inner life is the way I have to start everything that I do. How I feel about the situation I'm in, how I feel about the other characters. And then I start kind of adding physicality. I feel like Kevin Jay is a very expressive character and a very expressive person, but in this instance, in a strange place where he doesn't know how he's going to be seen or accepted, he's contained. So it has to come out somewhere, and it came out in my hands. Kevin puts on this plaid thing. He says he's incognito because he's going to be blending in with the natives, but he just looks like a gay lumberjack. So I didn't actually get to meet Kevin Young until after our run in La Jolla, California at La Jolla Playhouse. I got an email in the middle of the night that says, hi, my name's Kevin and I think you play me in a musical. And he started telling me stories about his time in Gander and there were always funny quips and he always had kind of a, a sassy take on everything. Yes, I'm still here where they eat rainbows for breakfast. Are you taking care of mom? No, I'm just freaking out. I wish I was home. I remember when the other Kevin in the show came to see it, he said, oh my gosh, you have this guy down so well, which is, which is a testament to the writing. Another character that I play is named Ali, and he is an Egyptian man who is also Muslim. This is more of a composite of a couple of people. This character was amazing because just on the page you saw how proud this man was. I am Ali, and I am an American. The more I found out about this character, the more I, I heard about his fear for his family and his fear for his children at a time of great uncertainty for Muslim Americans. That turns into a physicality in terms of how I started holding my hands, how I started looking at people, how I started reacting to people, whether I would look at people at all. There's a moment where he walks onto a bus and all eyes are on him and I felt that this is a place that he would hold his head up high and lead with his chest and look at everybody in the eye as he's going to his seat and make sure that everybody on that bus saw who this man was. Then we started working with our dialect coach, what consonants are being um, emphasized when you speak, how someone may try to uh, slow down a bit when English is not their first language and when they want to be very clear that they are being heard. Sometimes when people think I'm not looking, I catch them looking at me and I can see the fear in their eyes. You have to do this for every kind of audition that you go in for. You have to think about where this person is from, how they speak, how they look at somebody else in the space, how they carry themselves and why they're carrying themselves that way. It's really exciting to watch and come from away, but this is part of the actor's craft. <laughs> 